Which brings us to zombies. because um, it actually works on me, it actually horrifies me, yeah. and I have nightmares, and it's sad, and I'm still in here, even though I don't like zombies. We accept you. I, Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. No, no. I'll come out too, I'm not. So it will interest you to know that I wound up, actually, one of the first songs I released in my short, unseemly career was um, the theme song to a zombie film. Um, it's called Zombie Cheerleading Camp. Yeah. <laughs> Someone called me and said, Will you write the theme song to my movie? And I said, Oh, yeah, that sounds awesome. What's it called? And he's like, Zombie Cheerleading Camp. And I was like, <laughs> What's it about? <laughs> but I wrote it, and it's awesome. It's a punk song. Yeah. It's badass. It's a little three piece kick ass band out of Anchorage uh, joined me on it so that I actually sound like a badass punk rock singer. Um, but we're not going to do that tonight because if I did it every night on tour, my vocal cords would no longer exist. And also, it's not really me. It's sort of like me doing a parody. So I'm going to do a sincere zombie song instead. Yeah. Not an ironic zombie song. This is a sincere zombie song. This is a sincere zombie cheerleader breakup song. Uh, and I mean it. <laughs> and <laughs> so this is the this is the sincere folk um, uh, acoustic campfire iron and wine kind of a, a version of we're out for blood and what I need you to do is envision um, zombie cheerleaders. Can you picture? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Undead cheerleaders. Oh, yeah. All right. Oh, yeah.
actually scarier than everyone else's. And I've been to all 50 states, I know. Even in Detroit. Even in Detroit. They're pretty cool. Oh, they're Detroit. Detroit. Detroit doesn't even compare to Massachusetts. I'm sorry. <laughs> Even though your grandma and all your Mormon aunts are your friends. 